And that is you need a base level skill. You have to be able to uh, have enough skill set that they would even want to employ you for any reason. Um, somebody could come to me today and say, hey, look, I I'm here, I'll help, I'll do whatever you need me to, and that's great and all. But if that is a true fact, then you need to put in some type of education towards uh, obtaining the skills to be able to do some particular job so that way you can be employed now. You can be employed uh, on a particular application at this moment and maybe not even as a skilled engineer who can um, perform the task on their own but an engineer who uh, can at least sit with another engineer and be taught and, and have a, a basic vocabulary of what's going on and understanding of what's going on and maybe an understanding of different programming languages. Um, and so a, a few things that I'd find very, very valuable is if you could do PLC programming, robot programming, or a structured text programming language. Uh, any of those three will definitely accelerate you in being able to uh, be of value to an automation integrator.